One system tells you exactly what to do, step by step. The other tells you what's wrong and waits. So, which one actually makes pilots safer? In Airbus aircraft, ECAM doesn't just alert you. It prioritizes the failure, suppresses distractions, and walks the crew through actions in sequence. Memory items appear automatically. Systems are reconfigured as you work. The philosophy is simple. Reduce cognitive load when things go wrong. You manage the situation. The system manages the checklist logic. Boeing takes the opposite approach. IKs tells you what has failed, not how to fix it. Pilots identify the alert, select the correct checklist and manage priorities themselves. The system informs, the crew decides. This preserves situational ownership, but demands deeper system knowledge under pressure. Airbus assumes overload is the danger, so it guides. Boeing assumes loss of understanding is the danger, so it steps back. One protects against confusion, the other protects against complacency. Both meet the same safety standards, they just trust different human strengths. So here's the real question. When something breaks at altitude, do you want the aircraft to lead you through the problem? or to make sure you fully understand it. Guided problem solving or raw situational control.